How's it going YouTube? Coming at you guys with another YouTube review. This time it's not a sneaker review, but it is a product review that I got for you guys. And it is the Creprotec Cure, which you got right here. And uh, let me go ahead and show you guys what's in the package. So this is basically a, your cleaner for your sneakers. And uh, comes in a nice packaging. You got your crab little booklet here, which is pretty cool. You got your, it tells you what's in the product and uh, how to use it basically. And then you got your crab protect microfiber towel, which is pretty nice that they added this in there. <clears throat> so let's put that on the side. So you got your booklet, your little microfiber towel, you got your crab your crap little brush here. These bristles are kind of sturdy, a little bit on the harder side, but uh, it definitely does look premium. It is premium, which it says right there. You got your crap logo right there, which we'll put that on the side as well. And well, you got your solution, which is a crap protect solution, and. Uh, Basically, it tells you how to use it, the caution, and the, let's get the focus on here, the cleaning guide, which I won't read that, but I'll show you guys on the, on the little sleeve it came with on the package. It's basically a little sleeve here, and it does tell you, let's see if I can get this open. So it basically tells you how to use it. Step one, step two, step three, four, five, and six. So yeah, that basically is what the sleeve, the information on the sleeve is, uh, just how to use it, this and that, and uh, the packaging. It is a pretty nice packaging, good to have it on the go in your bag or whatever. It does have a yellow inside on there with a little moisture package in there. So yeah, I'm also going to be doing a review on this, which is a Crep Protect, the Ultimate Rain and Stain Resistant Barrier. This will be on another video right here, but uh, for now let's get into the cleaning. I will be doing the cleaning on these uh, Adidas Ultra Boost in the Triple White, which are pretty dirty. A couple scuffs and uh, they, these white shoes do get pretty dirty. so. We'll see. We'll see how it goes and uh, I'll let you guys know if I recommend it or not. This will be a review on the product. I don't get paid for any of this so it will be an honest review on this. See a little stain right there. See if we can get that off. Then uh, we'll take the laces off. So let's get to the cleaning. So here's the shoes that I'm going to be working with. I already took the laces off. Uh, here's the other one. See a little dirt right there that you can see. I don't know how good you guys can see with this lighting, but uh, they are pretty dirty. And they are white, so they do get dirty pretty fast. But I went ahead and take the laces off, and uh, it says on the package to use warm water. So I did put some warm water in here. And it doesn't say how much solution to use, but uh, it just says to use a generous amount. So I'll just throw a couple drops in there. Let's see. couple drops in there and then it says to dunk the brush in the solution and then it also says to use some solution on the brush so go ahead and do that this little container is not that great but it's what I had so let's get to cleaning the shoes right here
looks like it's starting to foam up a little bit. You know what, let me go ahead and take these insoles out before they get wet. So this is my second go on this. Uh, it's looking pretty clean. I'm liking how it's looking. Still foamed up, still cleaning it. Um, for the most part, it looks like it took off all the stains. Continue cleaning it there. Clean that boost material. Boost midsole. Gotta keep that clean. It did have some scuffs right here on the uh, heel cup, which pretty much took off, which that's great. As you can see, it looks a little shiny because of the water, but overall, I'm impressed. Let me just say this product smells real good also, so definitely is a plus on that as well. It's always good when you have a product that smells good. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it on the camera, but this one's a clean one. This one's the one I haven't cleaned yet. You can see like a stain right there. This one I already cleaned. But you can kind of see a stain right there. Right here. But I'll go ahead and hit that again. This back part was pretty dirty dirty but uh overall it's looking pretty clean now these shoes do have like some grayish in here so they're not 100 percent white white so they're not gonna look like bam hella bright but uh overall i'm liking the product it looks like it would look it works well the laces what i'm gonna do, be doing with the laces is uh after i'm done i'm just gonna dunk them in there they're not that bad, they don't look that bad, so I'll just dunk them in there, wash them, and uh, I'm gonna hit the other shoe right now, and I'll show you guys what it looks like once I'm done with both sneakers. Uh, after cleaning the shoes, I went ahead and rinsed them and everything. They're looking very, very clean. Definitely, the product is a good product. So, after cleaning the shoes, and uh, wiping them down with the Crepitec Cure rag, the uh, little microfiber rag that they give you. Check this out. Look at all that dirt that's gonna come out of here. So I just want you guys to see that. My sink is cracked in case you guys saw that. But uh, I wanted you guys to see that, all the dirt that came off of the shoes wiped them down with the rag and uh, that's basically what came out so yeah so here's the end result on the Creprotect uh, Cure overall it is a great product love it it did clean the shoes very well which I that was the purpose of it and uh, yeah overall it's a great product here's the shoe that I am finished with I don't know how bright it's gonna come out on the camera, but uh, you have some scuffs here which didn't come off, but uh, those will come off with a little bit more rubbing. And uh, yeah, overall a great product. I definitely recommend it. It does run for $18. Let's get that on camera. $18, I did pick up, pick this up at my local boutique. Uh, I don't know where you guys could, uh, where else you guys could get it, maybe finish line or something like that, but I doubt it. But I'll put a link below that way you guys could check it out. And uh, yeah, that's the end product. Overall, great product. Peace.